sensor in my feet The great Emerald's power allows me to feel I can't see a thing but it's around somewhere I gotta hold my head Okay, I like this puzzle. Pull the seaweed out of the way, get a prize. I like the puzzles where I get to use my grabby arm and I don't have to carry a bunch of bubbles. Wow, I really... that was pretty spot on. It really is just pull the tentacles out of the way, get a prize. Except I don't really have to pull them out of the way, except for some of them. Oops, it's 4.10 right now. Do you think I should just stay up all night and then go to bed early? Come on, Keith is, is exhausted. I'm pretty tired too. I woke up relatively early for a weekend, and I am gonna try to go into work early next week. Because, when you... oh yeah, I'm going, I'm going to the big anime fair. Uh, I mean, I'm going to Otakon, so I'm taking time off work, so I need to do extra work. When is that? Go to Otakon, you get my autograph, I have a booth there, I don't actually have a booth there, I'm kind of embarrassed that I'm going, but I'm doing it with friends, um, I'll probably make a video about this later because I don't think anyone's gonna watch this, thank, thank, thank you. Oops. When is Otakon? Otakon's, uh, 26th through 20th. I think, or maybe 27 through 29. No, hey, pin missile. Haha. -ha. Oh, you died. I feel bad now. Do you think if I chainsaw, they just break and don't hurt me? You should probably take out your chainsaw and just try to. try to. persona. persona 4. I shouldn't just assume that doing nothing is the correct response. If I fall asleep, I'm gonna be asleep for 10 hours with Persona 4 running right next to my head. That's gonna kill you. You're not going to survive that. I have really long bad dreams anyway. Yeah, you're... you're I'm gonna have the worst... No, I don't wanna go into the vacuum. It's it, you're going to the robot place. Oh, I like how that looked like it was a plot or a cutscene transition, but it just yeah, wasn't. Yeah, it wasn't. That's pretty cool. Oh, oh look, it's a big, uh, oh no, it's, oh wait, no, it's a, it is a big thing. Uh oh, I think that just hurt me. Wait, yeah, it just kind of respawned me. Um, what do you think I do? Do you think I grab onto the. Try sawing these things. Oh, I make it eat the. Oh, little Rockies, those. Can I grab onto his hands? Yes, I can. You can't put your hands in your mouth. What I've is it, the big blooper before. fight? Yeah, this is a good blooper. Okay, I like this fight. Okay, come and get me big tennis, tennis pistols. Oops, okay, well... It just, like, teleports me randomly. That's really disorienting. Er, no, that's not... Eh, phew. Oh, as many Tim Burton jokes we're making, I do like the art direction in this game. Yeah, it is, it is a pretty game so far. And there's no more spiders because you're underwater? Yeah, spiders can't live underwater. Was that the end of the boss or is it going to come out for phase two? Oh, I guess, yeah. Is the, is like the control good so far and the different platforming things? Uh, yeah, I don't feel like the controls have been the fault of any of the deaths or anything I've had. So the underwater bits are just the same as the regular controls, right? Charge beam? Oh. Oh, whoa. Does that just follow my map? Ooh, uh, okay, this is really cool. Are the underwater controls the same as yeah, the out of water controls? Exactly the same. 
Okay. There's like maybe a slight speed thing, but it's if there is, it's not enough that I'm even sure that it exists. They say when a platformer has solid water levels, you know it's a good platformer. Is that, uh, that's what I thought about Rayman Origins. Rayman Origins was a good game, and the underwater levels, it, oh. at, at least on consoles, were really good. Rayman's Apparently kind on of PC a they were bad. A plock ripoff? Yeah. Plock has some good fucking music. Plock had good water levels. Plock had a beach level. You had to catch your. You had to go to the beach and you. The you hot got a dog salesman. By mistake. Hot dog salesman. I'm just gonna more. pretend I really like Plock, even though I've never played it, and I feel like it would be really unpleasant to play because I'm not very good at platformers. I just recently beat Super Mario Bros. for the first time. Oh yeah, uh, I LP'd that and I was bad at video games back then, but I don't really like how that game's difficulty works. Oh, oh, this is a fun mechanic. I, I feel bad that I just ruined this puzzle and I'm not sure really how to fix it because I'm supposed to block all three of those and some of them have to be blocked with the rocks. And now the rocks are blown up. I, I probably just like irreversibly ruined the game. Like I just can't get 100% completion anymore. Dover Power. It's okay. Do you think the guys behind Little Big Planet, Insane Little Big Planet, would do that to me? Oh no, I just get to go on a fucking fetch quest for these giant sponges' babies. Wait, do they? Do these explode when they're out of the water? Of course they do. Okay, I can. I mean, I'm not sure why I complain every time there's a mechanic. I just kind of feel obligated. Do you think I need to be here, or do I need to get a third one? I don't really know what this could possibly be doing for me, other than the fact that it's a thing. I should probably go get a third one, I guess. Yeah, I guess that sign will probably turn on once I have a third one. <sighs> you can do it. Keith, will you go look up how long this game is to see if it's feasible for me to beat it before it gets really late? What's the name of that one site? Game GameLength.com? How long does it take to beat a game.com? It takes 28 hours and 3 minutes to beat Ocarina of Time, just the main story, <laughs> and it takes 27 hours and 14 minutes to beat it with the all the side and quests the and the main story. It's, uh, it's too long, you can't play it. Alright, let's see. Insanely twists... Hmm, pers persona... Persona 4. He, I know it's really sleepy out, but you gotta, you gotta bear with me. You gotta, you gotta just use bear force, bear force it through. Bear force one. <laughs> Guys, I feel bad for Mateo Nova because he's messaging me on Skype and he just <laughs> he's having a nice plate of uh, flap cakes. <laughs> Don't, don't, don't <laughs> tell people that, Keith. I'm gonna, uh, he's I'm just gonna, joshing. I'm gonna edit this. I know he's just joshing, but... Don't need to say that. Edit, hey, edit in, edit in me saying... I'll say it right now so you can edit it in over what I said before. Edit in. I sure could go for a nice steaming bun right now. Fuck cakes. Edit that in there, and then keep it where I just said it. <laughs> and then people know that you said something I didn't want them to hear yeah, because no, that's there's the point. this conversation. That's the idea. And then over over me having that conversation with you, you can edit this in. Man, I sure could go for a nice steaming bun right now. This fucking game, I just... I gotta... <laughs> no, no, look at this fucking game. I just... The puzzle I did to get into this room is now... I have to go undo it to solve that puzzle. 
Oh, Darvo, Darvo. I don't even know how I'll get back out. Oh, I guess maybe the door is just permanently open. Does this hurt me if I hold on to it when it blows up? Probably. I mean, it would make sense. Uh, if it did, it didn't even do a full level of damage. I wish this game didn't even have hotkeys, because it's not really that hard to, like, right-click and, uh... Right-click and... Are they respawn? Are they, like, breeding? Oh, I don't know. But yeah, it's not hard to right-click and select, it's just the fact that hotkeys exist make me want to use them. Oh, maybe it did hurt me one level. I wonder if I'm just gonna start getting those upgrades soon. I really want to get the gravity arm upgrade, even though it might not exist. Okay, so I guess the other one's gonna come... Or no, that puzzle's just already done now, I guess, because... Yeah, okay, that water line's feeding. You know, I, I'm aware of the little thing you said about water levels as a joke, but... This is actually, like, a typically fun for a water mechanic, in my opinion. I'm not sure how I feel about these. Mm. The steering's a little dodgy on this, I mean, it's supposed to be, but... Oops! Okay, clicking detonates. I knew that, I just kind of accidentally clicked because I was about to hit a wall. It's like, oh, maybe if I click, I'll turn on a dime. I can't tell if the game's lagging or if it's just the slow motion mode it's putting me in for this. It's not me breathing into the mic because I'm not breathing that frequently. Keith, calling Calamari Keith. Calamari Keith, it's falling through the cry, it's falling through. Man, Persona 4 is a good game, but I sure don't want to fall asleep with it running and then have nightmares about it. Have nightmares about Persona 4. Can I explain something really quickly for those who haven't played that game? Yes. Part of the mechanic is building friendships with people, and then there's an RPG element to that later where it levels up things that you get as you grow closer to your friends. And you just grow closer to them by talking with them or hanging out with them or, you know, you find out more about their past and who they are as individuals. Uh, in Persona 4, they added a new mechanic for how you get to, uh, get to know your pals. Uh, sometimes you have a dream about them. And it's never anything, like, logical. Uh, one of the dreams I had, I was wrestling with my friend, with one of my friends wearing a luchador mask. And then the game told me that I was closer to that person. Which I don't really understand, but... Have you, you just know. never had friends before in real life? I've had, never had a dream that I was wrestling with one of them in luchador masks. That's sad. After which I felt accomplished, and I felt like our relationship has intensified. That's, that's really sad. Persona 4! Makes me very angry, Keith. Makes me real sleepy, Keith. Persona Ugh. 4 is a good game. I've never played Persona 4. <laughs> I have a friend who's played Persona 3. Call more Keith. I'm the only guy who's played Persona 3. Yeah. Because my uncle works at, um, at, what's at it Atlas. Called, uh... Video games dudes liked it, and they usually have- they recommended Bastion to me, and I really liked that. My- my- well, guess what? My uncle works at Atlas, and I met... Iwata? I'm sorry, I made this joke in the last part of the Pokemon LP. Wait, so this... This area exists solely to be... 
a spawning point for these mushroom looking guys. Here we get a fresh porn one. Is there even any water in between here and... Okay, there is. Okay, it looks like it's ab about to explode a lot faster than it actually does. That's kind of disorienting. Don't blow up my sh- Okay, I hope that just randomly stays there. Even though I die. <laughs> I hope that there's less than no punishment for death. I hope that it technically just counted as a heal. And the puzzle is equally far along as it was before I died, stupidly. Okay, well I need to do that anyway before bringing the suckers over here. Oh, that thing's kind of gross. Yeah. How many power-ups do you have left? Are you supposed to fill that entire pool menu? I would there? assume so. Hmm. Uh, so... four? And I don't know how high levels any of them are gonna get. I know there's Didn't... at least one more level of shielding and, uh, gun. Didn't you have one of those power-ups at, like, five out of six for the little artifact things you gotta find? That was find? just the artifacts that increased the plot. Oh. I think. Damn it! Can I grab these? No, of course not. Just be too easy. Piece of cake. I'm sorry, that was a bad joke. <laughs> oh, he's insane. I like how those things are just getting bigger. Every time I see one, it's just really big. <laughs> so when you shoot a rocket, you just direct it with the mouse, right? Yeah. Okay. Okay, I really hope if I die, I keep my progress here because... Stupid guys. Yeah, you get him, Bubble Power. Okay, I'm gonna cry if I have to re-break that first one. I'll actually start editing. Okay, how how much of the map is left? Can I zoom out? Yeah. Okay, I'm probably not going to beat this game in one sitting. I never I never finished looking up how long it was. Uh, uh, based on the map size, it's long enough that I'm not going to finish one thing. Okay. Oops. Okay, yeah, now finally Google is yelling at me. Keith? Yeah. Okay, good. At least it still lets me hear you. Um, yeah, it, it, just, it just it just says me there. Just, I don't know if it's just gonna automatically end or something. I guess, you know what, if it automatically ends and you don't respond for a while, I'm going to assume either Google uh, kicked me out for being lazy, or you fell asleep, but either way, we've probably done enough for tonight. Videogamelength.com How long, How long is, is my Mass Effect 3? Put spaces between all the words in it. Like, canspidersfart.com Canspidersfart. Oh. The 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 first thing that comes up. Oh, how long to beat dot com? Search games and users. Zeki Space Funny Planet. Lonely Space. Little Space Planet. Oh wow! Oh, <laughs> Little Space, space Planet. Planet. Uh. Mm, average time is four hours. How long have we been playing? Uh, Fuck. Fuck. Uh, I don't know. I don't know when we started. Oh, I like how I have really inconsistent amounts of swearing in my videos. Like, usually I'm just idly not very swear swearing guy. 
and I try not, to keep it friendly. Usually you're just idly not very swearing. I, I mean, I don't normally swear very much, but like, I just really get... If I'm slightly flustered, I'll just start saying fuck a lot, but like, not in an emotionally invested way. So I guess, retroactively, don't watch this video if you're offended by profanity for some reason. It's a little late for that, Prower. Yeah, that's what I said, retroactively, don't watch it. Oh, okay. You know, when you're offended by something, so instead of being upset, you just go back in time and don't watch it. Oh, okay, were there just three on this side the entire time and you didn't actually have to go to the baby spawner unless you screwed up? Oh wait, this thing's roots were like preventing the water flow. Or something. There's my Google checkup. That was really annoying. Oh, it worked. Complete ocean. Okay, so I'm guessing those achievements are for beating different areas of the main planet. And the areas of beaten so far are landing site, ocean, and biological. Don't forget Nightmare Before Christmas. <laughs> Nightmare Before Christmas, uh, Howl's Moving Castle, and, uh, Bastion. I like how I was trying to think of a Tim Schafer game, and the first one that came to mind was Bastion. Okay, That's a Tim this Schafer is game. my favorite thing that I've done in the game. Oh, I like how the other snakes don't care, <laughs> as opposed to the birds. The birds would just swarm you if you did that. I think the birds were swarming me anyway, but yeah. <laughs> Just go through the rest of the game with that. It's better than the buzz saw. Oh. <laughs> Wait, am I it's still in Octaria? Okay, what? Do you think I should go to the left? Okay, that's gonna take me to the next area, maybe. Are you just naming these yourself, or is it from the little Achievos? Aquaria is maybe the name of the water level in Super Metroid. Or maybe the name of the game Aquaria. <laughs> That's actually probably it. Okay, so... Do you think my big, big missile is gonna let me get into this area here? Oh, was this just an area so I wasn't very explory at? Oh, my big missile can actually kind of go through the waterfall. Okay, let's see if just going really fast to the left. Ah. Alright, this is what I was talking about. <laughs> I wish that this drill made an obnoxious noise whenever you used it. You can tell if a video game is good if it makes unpleasant sound effects. I wonder if there's anything important up here. Oh, I like this area. the feeling when you brush your teeth. Oh, okay. Teeth. Alright, I'm assuming Google dropped me. Uh, poor Keith didn't get to see the grind in your teeth, or grind in your rocks, or the little cutscene with the giraffes. <sighs> so I guess I'm just gonna explore this area and go up to the checkpoint and hope that checkpoints are also save points. I guess I can't see any reason why they wouldn't be, but I'm always a little scared when I'm playing a game for the first time. I don't know if it'll actually properly save or not. I wonder what's... There's that one area, it's probably just a tiny bit of the ceiling, but I'm upset that it's not on my map. I'm gonna go explore that and then I'll try and hit a checkpoint. Oh, okay, there's a checkpoint right here. Okay, 
because I'm sure if you're still watching at this point, you're just as fascinated as I am about the dumb map. Okay, wasn't anything there. So yeah, the verdict. This is a pretty fun game. Um, if it goes on sale again during the seam stale today for the last day of it, I guess I recommend it. I, I got this because it was cheap and looked interesting, and I'd say I've gotten 375 or whatever worth of entertainment out of it so far, and I'm halfway done or so, I'm guessing. Uh, thanks for watching, and stay tuned for recording session two, which based on the remainder of the map will probably be the rest of the game.